just like uh, defensively and playing fast and just the type of uh, people they have on the team. Cause they also got some teams from uh, some people from Queens. I mean, not Queens, New York too. So it's just they probably gonna have the same emotions we have just being back home. I mean, has it really set in for you that you're gonna be playing in Madison Square Garden? Nah, it's still settling. <laughs> it's still settling. It's probably not gonna settle in until I hit the court, you know. But hopefully it settles in soon. Something you dream about as a kid? Yeah, I always dreamt about it as a kid. You know, now that my family can see me being a part of that, it's just, you know, it's a great feeling to have. When you were a kid, you ever come here for any other events? Uh, just to watch some NBA games growing up, a couple of Knicks games. That's probably pretty much it. And now you're sitting in that locker room, man. What's going through your mind? I think this is the, the Knicks locker room, right? So this is probably somebody's locker room sitting at right now. <laughs> it's a kind of a crazy feeling, you know? So I don't know. I just... And I'm sure you dreamed of this moment as a kid, right? You know, on the playground, you know, everybody talks about MSG, where you're from, in Queens, and just to be here. You're about to go on the floor and practice. You're playing in a game tomorrow to potentially go to the Elite Eight, man. Is this, is this like a dream come true for you? It, it really is. You know, I got a lot of people reaching out to me. A lot of people that I haven't talked to in years is reaching out to me just to tell me that they always followed me and they always supported me and everything I did. So it's just a, a really crazy feeling to have. And, uh, for you guys playing against Michigan State, I know you got an early scout in the books. What have you seen from them that maybe you guys think that you can exploit or maybe you think maybe a little tough? It's going to be a tough game. They're going to come ready just like we're going to come ready. They're going to throw jabs. We're going to throw jabs. It's just going to be about the last one standing, you know, just who's going to keep fighting, who's going to keep pushing and to get to the, the W.